Hi, my name is Eileen Perez and I'm an astrophysicist and this is which planet exerts the least pull of gravity. So the, the thing to think about here is that the gravitational force of a planet is the gravitational constant which is about 6.67 times 10 to the minus 11 uh, meter cubed per kilogram second square multiplied by the first mass the second mass, and the distance between them, square. So generally when we're looking at a planet, we can see, okay, we have, let's say, the first mass is a piece of rock on the surface, and the second one is the mass of the planet. So let's call this the mass of the planet instead of mass 2. It also has to do with how far you are from the star. So oh, from the actual uh, other object, so the distance between them. Generally, in, in, uh, in our solar system, the planets with the least amount of mass have less amount of gravity since the force of the gravitational pull goes with the mass. So we have to think about what are the possible candidates. So the outer planets are gas giants, and they're actually very massive. Therefore, they have a really large gravitational pull. The, therefore, it cannot be one of the uh, gas giants. So it has to be one of the terrestrial planets. And the smallest planet in the solar system right now is uh, Mercury. So Mercury is the, the best candidate to have the least amount of gravitational pull. And so, f so therefore Mercury has the least gravitational pull. My name is Eileen Pires and I'm an astrophysicist.